With an increase in international trade and freedom in global travel, all kinds of animals, plants, and their products are circulated widely. This has consequently increased the risk of spreading animal and plant diseases and pests around the world. Sanitary and phytosanitary measures are essential for preventing the invasion of animal and plant diseases and pests that may cause severe damage to our agriculture and environment. The Bureau of Animal and Plant Health Inspection and Quarantine was officially established in 1998. It has four branch offices which are located in Keelong, Xinju, Haizhong, and Kaohsiung. The Keelong branch office is located right by the Keelong Harbor. The animal quarantine, plant quarantine, meat inspection, and general affairs sections are in charge of animal and plant inspection and quarantine, and the inspection of meat hygiene. This is also carried out by inspection stations in Taipei, Xizhi, Suao, Hualien, and Mazu. The main objectives of the Keelung branch office include inspection and quarantine of imported and exported animals, plants and their products in the jurisdiction, on-site inspection of establishments producing animals, plants or related products, supervision of hygienic management in slaughterhouses, monitoring and reporting of animal and plant diseases and pests, cooperation with local governments to supervise animal and plant protection. It inspects animals, plants and related products carried by passengers at ports of entry. Strict implementation of inspection and quarantine not only ensures our agricultural production, but also safeguards our nation's biosafety. The General Affairs section handles matters related to quarantine application and certification. In the last two years, it processed an average of 23,000 application cases per year. The public may apply for inspection or quarantine of imported goods through the internet, telephone, fax, computer input, or in person. After acceptance and payment of fees, the office will dispatch personnel to conduct on-site inspections. According to inspection results, a certificate of approval or notice of disapproval will be issued. For the public's convenience, the General Affairs section has set up an all-purpose front desk for receiving and processing applications and the entire procedure has been computerized to simplify the administrative process. The General Affairs section has also set up a special waiting area for business operators to create a more friendly service while creating a more convenient, efficient and comfortable environment. quarantine and plant quarantine sections are responsible for the inspection and quarantine of imported animals, plants and related products at the Keelong Harbor, 
and supervising and assisting the inspection stations within the jurisdiction. Only approved animals, plants and related products are allowed to enter Taiwan. Once an animal, plant or related goods are found to be infested with pathogens or other harmful pests, it must be returned to the port of origin, destroyed, or subjected to proper quarantine treatment and released after the harmful pests are eradicated. In the past two years, the office has inspected 9,900 lots of animal products and 13,500 lots of plant products per year. Animal or plant products brought by cruise line passengers are also important targets for inspection. Smuggled animals or plant products are entirely destroyed or treated according to regulations. Keelong branch office inspectors have even traveled abroad to conduct inspections at sites where goods for export to Taiwan are produced to minimize the risk of introducing plant diseases or pests. In order to facilitate the export of domestic agricultural goods, the office provides inspection and certification services for export goods in compliance with the requirements of importing countries. To promote efficiency of quarantine procedures, the office immediately issues phytosanitary certificates right at inspection sites for imported fresh fruits and vegetables that meet phytosanitary requirements. For bulk grain, the plant quarantine section conducts inspection on board to save time and to relieve congestion in the port. The animal quarantine section also provides at-home quarantine services for guide dogs owned by the visually impaired. As animal and plant quarantine has become a great international concern of most countries, it's important for us to follow international standards and improve technology and effectiveness in terms of inspection and quarantine so that biosafety can be ensured and international trade can be facilitated as well. The meat inspection section of the Keelong branch office oversees five meat and poultry slaughterhouses. Supervision of sanitary management in meat and poultry establishments. Slaughterhouse sanitary inspection. Checking for illegal slaughterhouses. Management of sites producing meat for export. These provide hygienic meat and poultry for the greater Taipei, Ilan, and Hualien areas. Professional veterinarians carefully inspect the meat and poultry products before they hit the market. If signs of disease are found in the meat or innards, the produce is destroyed immediately, and the meat or poultry establishment in question is informed of the inspection results so it can enhance its disease management and prevention work. The meat and poultry products that pass the inspection are stamped with BAFIC's seal of approval. Every year around 1.2 million pigs and 13 million chickens pass the inspection. The meat inspection section is also active in educating the public to identify and purchase hygienic meat and poultry products. The stringent inspection of meat and poultry establishments not only provides the public with safe and hygienic meat and poultry products, but also makes possible the early discovery and prevention of animal disease outbreaks.
The Type A inspection station's major responsibilities are inspection and certification of exported animals, plants, and related goods, examination of postal parcels from overseas, and the supervision of hygienic conditions of meat and poultry establishments in Taipei County. The Taipei Inspection Station is also responsible for the quarantine of animals transferred in and out of the Taipei Zoo. Plant quarantine deals primarily with the inspection of flowers, seeds and wood materials leaving the jurisdiction for export. The Taipei Inspection Station also dispatches inspectors to the producing establishments to carry out on-site inspection or disinfection. The Taipei Inspection Station regularly dispatches personnel to the Jinnan and Da'an postal offices to conduct inspections of postal parcels. The Taipei Inspection Station also oversees hygienic inspections and supervision of meat and poultry establishments in the greater Taipei area. The Shichir Inspection Station is the site of the nation's major imported animal quarantine center. It currently consists of one poultry isolation room, six large animal isolation rooms, three greenhouses, one laboratory, and one office. Its main mission is the quarantine of imported animals. All animals other than canines, felines, and wild animals entering Taiwan must be quarantined at the Shichu Inspection Station. Only healthy animals are released after a serial of a health checkup, blood test, stool examination, and other necessary tests. Vehicles carrying the animals for quarantine must undergo complete disinfection before and after unloading the animal. The related data will be forwarded to the local animal protection authorities for follow-up inspections. Elan is abundant in agricultural and aquatic products and is an important provider of domestic agricultural products for export. The Suao Inspection Station is located in the Suao Harbor District and is in charge of inspecting animals and plants as well as issuing certificates for export. Inspected plant and related products for export include silver willow, orchids, lumber, saplings, and seeds. Inspected animals and related products for export include ornamental fish, frozen ducks, duck eggs, frozen fish, as well as fish feed and shrimp feed. It is also in charge of the hygienic inspections of pork and chicken slaughtering in the Elan area. Hualien Inspection Station receives inspection requests, issues certificates, and handles quarantine inspection work in the Hualien Airport and Hualien International Harbor.
The plants and plant products for export include wooden boards for crates, seeds, orchids, and saplings. In animals, inspections are carried out mainly on the canines and felines brought out of the country by tourists. The Hualien Inspection Station also helps the local stone export industry by assisting industry operators in disinfecting stones and fumigating wooden crate boards according to the regulations of importing countries. It also supervises inspection of meat hygiene standards in a slaughterhouse in the Hualien area. To facilitate the cross-strait Mini-3 links, the Mazu Inspection Station was set up on January 1st of 2001. It consists of three inspection offices, the Fuao office at Nangan Village, the Nangan Airport Inspection Counter, and the Beigan Airport Inspection Office. Mainland China is the infestation area of many serious animal and plant diseases and pests. Therefore, the Fuao office carries out stringent inspections on goods and products brought in by cross-strait travelers. It prohibits most agricultural products, such as all kinds of fresh fruits, from entering Mazu, according to international sanitary and phytosanitary regulations. Travelers returning to Taiwan from Mazu can only bring locally produced animal or plant products, such as cooked meats and peanuts. Dogs and cats should receive valid vaccinations. All unqualified animals, plants, or related products are strictly prohibited. If found, they shall be returned or destroyed, so as to prevent animal or plant diseases from invading Taiwan. With the liberalization of global trade, the inspection and quarantine of animals and plants has received great attention, and many international standards have been formulated. Sanitary and phytosanitary measures are the keys to guaranteeing the safety of a nation's living beings, but they should not become a hindrance to international trade. The Keelong Inspection Station, being the first safeguard at the northern border, upholds the ideals of public convenience, effectiveness, and harmony. It is aggressive in upgrading its quarantine-related technology and is stringent in implementing the inspection and quarantine measures. It also continues to provide fast and convenient service and actively helps businesses and the general public alike. It hopes to play an essential role in creating a safe and superior domestic living environment and a bright future for international trade.